Number 10. The Mystery of the Voynich Manuscript The Voynich Manuscript is one of the most puzzling artifacts ever discovered. It's a book that was found in 1912 in Italy and is named after the rare book dealer who found it, Wilfred Voynich. What makes this book so mysterious is that no one can decipher its text or even figure out what language it's written in. The book has over 200 pages filled with strange illustrations of plants, stars, humans, and more. But all of the text has remained a complete mystery. Experts believe that the book may be a hoax, but even its origin and purpose are unknown. It could be a medieval encyclopedia, an ancient diary, or maybe even an alien text. But until we figure out how to translate it, the Voynich manuscript will remain one of the world's greatest mysteries. Gnome 9. The Baghdad Battery In 1936, a team of archaeologists was excavating a site in Iraq when they uncovered a collection of clay jars buried beneath a temple. And inside those jars, they found something incredible, a set of batteries from the Parthian Empire dating back to around 250 AD. These batteries were made by placing a copper tube inside a clay jar along with a ceramic core and an iron nail. When archaeologists first discovered them, they thought they might be incense burners. But when they cleaned them up, they realized that they were actually batteries. And since they were found in a location where there's evidence of early Christianity, some people believe that they may have been used to power devices like electric long. However, there's no concrete evidence to support this theory. 8. The Antikythera Mechanism the Antikythera Mechanism is an ancient Greek device that was discovered in 1902 off the coast of the Greek island of Antikythera. It's an incredibly complex piece of engineering that was created sometime between 200 and 70 BC. This device is considered to be the world's first analog computer because it's a highly advanced piece of machinery that was used for calculating astronomical data. It was likely used to track the movements of the planets and predict eclipses and other astronomical events. The Antikythera mechanism is incredibly valuable because it gives us a glimpse into the advanced technology of the ancient Greeks. It shows that they were capable of creating incredibly complex machines that were used for scientific purposes. Number 7. The Terracotta Army The Terracotta Army is a collection of life-sized terracotta sculptures that were created in the 3rd century BC to protect the tomb of the first emperor of China. It's one of the most incredible archaeological discoveries of all time because it's a remarkably preserved collection of ancient art. There are hundreds of sculptures in the terracotta army, each one unique and detailed. They range from soldiers to horses to chariots, and each one is a masterpiece of ancient Chinese art. The terracotta army was discovered in 1974 by Chinese peasants digging a well, and since then, it's become one of the most popular tourist attractions in China. Number 6. Dead Sea Scrolls The Dead Sea Scrolls are a collection of ancient Jewish text written between the last three centuries BC and the first century CE. They were discovered in the 1940s near the Dead Sea in caves in the West Bank. These scrolls are incredibly important because they contain some of the oldest known copies of the Hebrew Bible. They also provide a wealth of information about the history of ancient Judaism. The Dead Sea Scrolls were written during a time when the Jewish people were living under the rule of the Roman Empire, and they offer a unique perspective on this period of history. They were found in the caves of Qumran, which was likely the home of a Jewish sect known as the Essenes. Number 5. The Rosetta Stone The Rosetta Stone is a large black slab of granite that was discovered in 1799 by French soldiers in the Egyptian city of Rosetta. It contains a carved stone slab that served as the key to deciphering hieroglyphs. The Rosetta Stone is one of the most important artifacts ever discovered because it led to the decipherment of Egyptian hieroglyphs. The stone was originally created in 196 BC to commemorate the coronation of Ptolemy V. It contains a decree issued by the priests of the Egyptian gods, and it's inscribed in three different scripts, hieroglyphic, demotic, and Greek. It was the discovery of the Rosetta Stone that allowed us to unlock the secrets of ancient Egypt 
and understand their language and culture. Number four, the Lascaux cave paintings. The Lascaux cave paintings are a collection of prehistoric cave paintings that were discovered in southwestern France in 1940. They date back to the Upper Paleolithic period, around 15,000 years ago. These paintings are some of the earliest known examples of human artistic expression, and they provide a fascinating glimpse into the minds of our ancestors. The paintings were made by using natural pigments, such as ochre and charcoal, and they depict a wide variety of subjects, including animals, geometric patterns, and human figures. The Lascaux cave paintings are considered to be some of the finest examples of prehistoric art in the world. Number three, Pompeii and Herculaneum. Pompeii and Herculaneum are two Roman cities that were destroyed by the eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD. They were buried in ash and pumice, which preserved them in their final moments. These cities are now UNESCO World Heritage Sites, and they're open to the public. Visitors can explore the ruins of homes, temples, and other buildings, and get a sense of what life was like in Roman times. The preservation of these cities is truly remarkable, and they provide a unique window into the past. Number 2. King Tut's Tomb King Tut's tomb was discovered in 1922 by Howard Carter in the Valley of the Kings in Egypt. It was the first intact pharaoh's tomb to be found in nearly 2,000 years, and it contained a number of treasures, including the famous mask of Tutankhamun. The discovery of King Tut's tomb was a major event in the world of archaeology, and it captured the public's imagination. Number 1. The Shroud of Turin the Shroud of Turin is a piece of linen cloth that's believed by some to be the burial cloth of Jesus Christ. It's a controversial artifact because there's no conclusive evidence to prove or disprove its authenticity. However, many Christians believe that the Shroud is real and it provides physical evidence of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. The Shroud is currently housed in the Royal Chapel of the Cathedral of St. John the Baptist in Turin, Italy. Which of these discoveries was your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. See you next time. Bye.